Hey guys, welcome to another video of Game of Game Linux. Today I will be showing you a free first person shooter called Urban Terror. And if anyone has realised I am running the Windows version and I am aware that there is a Linux version. But for some reason I downloaded the Windows version. At the time I thought I was downloading the Linux version, but no, it was the Windows version. The game is very good, it's people sort of like compare it to what's it called? Counter Strike. It's a very cool game. But if you have watched my previous video of Call of Duty United Offensive then my internet is going slow, so hopefully it doesn't on this. Because it's a pain in the ass. Which I think it is. Ah, uh. No, I don't think it is. Whoa! But yeah, it's a really, really fun game. So it's quite cool. If you if you look in the bottom left, you see a little blood thing, and if you're bleeding, you can use a bandage. Come on, you're not bad. Go on. You can set up all your weapons so you have like silences on and stuff, which is rather cool. But be aware that this is the Windows version. This is it's not going to run as good as the Linux version, obviously. And I just screwed up and now I'm dead. Yes, I did the lemon thing. Oh yeah, I'll just show you the weapons in there. Uh, weapon gear select, so it's all, uh, you get to choose extra ammo, tactical goggles and stuff like that. Tactical goggles, some people might not like it. I've used it a couple of times, it's quite good actually. Um, it, it just like changes your view and I don't think you can turn it off. So it can get quite annoying. Mm -hmm. Now, I'll try it now. It's not letting me. Like that, and it basically points out where people are. But it's quite difficult to make out um, who your enemies are sometimes. It's very easy to see people. So it's just a high end stuff there. The internet seems to be running fine, so it's all good. I'm sure you can sprint, but I don't remember what the sprint button is. See, I thought that was my enemy then, but nope. How do you get up there? Hey. Run away! That sucks. He's behind me. Uh, you can try different weapons, you've got loads. Which is really really good for a free game. You can't really complain, can you? There you go. What? Yeah, you don't have a thing on it now. That's quite good as well, it points out where the grenades are and stuff. Like that, but I was too late to see it. I'm gonna take the silencer off. Give myself a laser sight. 
drone looks like. Uh, this gives you better accuracy. Well, <laughs> not really. Penis face. That is for a grenade. Oh, come on! 32% health. It's quite cool, it shows you how much health you have done. I like that. I like knowing how much people, um, how much health people have when you uh, get killed by them. Ah! Use a bandage. Ah! See, you just can't make out your bloody enemies, it's P take. Got a Kevlar vest on. It gives you more ammo. Oh, Jesus. That doesn't look too good, does it? But yeah, when, when you don't have the goggles on, you seem to get. I think it's easier to see the laser pointer. Ah, what the hell? Come on! What? take I just got shot I do oh my oh, I'm not doing so well for a free game it's got okay graphics but average you know it's... I like them but I'm not sure if any of that a lot of people complain about graphics because they're a bit arsey Ah, dead again. But I like the graphics, they're nice. They're good. M4A1. That's quite cool. I don't like that. So there you go, that's gameplay. It's got 